Hi, I'm Rob Martin. I'm hanging out at the next wave. We're doing an anti-stigma program here. The last two weekends we've been trying to get rid of, well, people's stereotypes and maybe, maybe even like in, people's stereotypes about stigma and inform people about the, so you can kind of learn more about the stigma. We're making posters and all that stuff and kind of like interacting with all these different types of activities and stuff like that. And right now we've made three poster, uh, two posters and a little card and you know they're just trying to get out to people saying that you know this stuff affects you and it affects me and it affects everybody and we should kind of get out there and try to stop it and I don't know it's just a lot of fun you know I'm learning things that I haven't I didn't know about before I didn't know half the stuff I knew now I mean you learn so much here and I come away from this thing with a lot of knowledge and hopefully I can give that out to other people you know and so they can learn something too. Hi, my name's Cassie. I became involved because I thought it would be a great way to get my community hours. I have learned how to deal with mental health issues and to help other people with their problems. I hope that this helps other people know that there is people and places they can go for help. Okay, um, hi, I'm Lindsay and my friend Rochelle told me about this campaign. And I'm not going to lie, the first thing that I thought when I heard about it were the community service hours. And after I attended the first week, I realized that it was more than that, and I learned a lot. When I hear the word mental health, I usually think of someone who looks like they're mentally ill, but learned that people that are mentally ill can look normal, but can be suffering inside. And I just, this program really gave me a like, different outlook on the way I should treat people, really and the way that they, I don't know, they could be like really not okay. And I wouldn't know that from just seeing them on the outside. So I think that it was good and it was very effective for me and hopefully it'll be effective for other people. My name's Courtney and I'm a child and youth worker, student doing my final placement at the Next Wave Youth Center. Um, Mind Your Mind approached us to do their anti-stigma project um, right here in this town. Um, I was kind of bummed it was gonna take place on the weekends, but I knew participating Participating in this campaign would um, help me exceed in my future career. Um, it sounded like fun, so I joined the team. I helped organize um, the event at the center and went to the high school to recruit youth. Um, I've learned a lot about myself and others during this weekend, and I hope to use this information um, in my day-to-day -day living um, to help people understand that they are not alone. Hi, I'm Kristen, and I joined this because I needed community service hours and because my friend thought it was about sex. Um, I've learned a lot. I've learned a lot about mental illnesses and like before I'd walk down the street and I'd be like, well, that person's crazy, but like they're the same as us. Like they're no different and people need to realize that. Like just because they have mental illness doesn't mean they're different than you or me or anybody else. Like. Well, I initially became involved in this campaign because I needed the community service hours. But then I came here and it was very different from what I expected it to be. I never thought we'd be talking about mental illness in a small town like this. So I've really learned a lot being here and I actually became a bit more interested in it and everything relating it once we got talking about it. And you realize that you have a lot more to say than you ever thought that you would, that you know a lot more than you thought that you would because there, there is a surprising amount of suicide and mental illness around us. We just don't realize it because we don't know what it is. And once you get talking about it, you can pick it up here and there and realize how many things need addressing around here, but they're just, they're just bigger problems that we get to beforehand. So I guess it's time for us to address this now. And that's why I got involved. How's that sound? Perfect. Here we go. Alright, you know what? I'm thinking mind you want to decide so balance.